Hmm. What's up, bro? We we don't understand your ways these days. How? What do you mean how? How now? How come you came to class that late? Mm -hmm. Eh, I might have slept off now. <laughs> Toby, you might have slept off. Toby, you, you slept off. Yes. When you vividly know we had an 8 o'clock class this morning. That's a lie. That's a big lie. <laughs> you know it. Which one is? It's a lie, it's a lie. Can I shock you? Shock somebody. I was back at the hostel, 10 minutes to the class to check on you. You were not there. Uh, I might have left the hostel before you arrived now. To where? To be to where? Wait, wait. What are, you, uh, what are you guys insinuating? That I left the class to somewhere else or what? <laughs> My brother. If you ask me, now who I go ask? You're the star, yeah. and that's just who you are. Shine bright like a diamond. I'm living up in the sky. I've got all it takes. I'm not giving up. I'm going straight to the top, and I'm never ever gonna lose my strength. Now it's gonna let me down. Yeah, now it's gonna make me frown. Flying like an eagle. That's why I'm so. Not Janet. What is she doing there? How will I know? Janet! Let's go and check up on her. I don't know what's wrong with her. Let's still carry the Janet! 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 What's wrong with you? What are you thinking about? Those girls are really getting on my nerves these days. Which of the girls are you talking about? Who else? Apart from Kiki and her friends. So, what have they done this time around? Those brainless girls think everyone is like them. How do you mean? Never mind. I know how to deal with them. Come on. These days, I don't really get this girl. I don't understand her. Seriously? Why do I have these feelings that that girl is up to something? Wait, do you really think so? Yes. We, we need, need to, to find out. out. Janet! Seriously, she's up to something. Janet! I will stand so high on the mountain top Where my hands could touch the sky And the world will see my light I will swing deep oceans I will run through the valley my light, my bright blue light. Oh, my heart won't be weary, and my eyes won't be teary. I won't say no to face obstacles. There is fire in my soul, 
Where's the face like this? Can you imagine that play called Naomi? <laughs> what has she done this time? She, she, she brought her leprosy, inflicted rags, and hung them close to mine. So, <sighs> where are the clothes? They're there. Ah. Why did you take my clothes off the line? The line your mother brought from her grave and made for you, Abby. Why would you speak about my mother in such contempt? Point of correction, my mom is still alive. Why would you hang your filthy rags close to my clothes? Or haven't you heard that what I find is level? That doesn't give you a reason to speak ill of my mother. Why are my clothes on the floor? They are with your witch of a mother in Abby's. What? Elena, that didn't sound right. Naomi, what are you doing with this mad dogs? I washed and hung my clothes on this line. Elena took them off. I asked her why and she started attacking my mom. Elena, what's the meaning of that nonsense? All these lines are owned by everybody and anybody is free to use a vacant line. So how is Naomi different from anybody else? Naomi has sickle cell anemia and she ought to be quarantined. So how does this correlate with you dragging her mother into your frustration? Ah. <laughs> I beg, see me see damn question. No. Hey. Sure. <laughs> Firstly, anybody that does not respect his or her parents mm. does not regard the parents of anybody else. <laughs> Secondly, madam, why are the clothes there? Do you have a problem with that? <laughs> yes, I do have a problem with that. <laughs> <laughs> I will beat you, you eh? No, 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 allow me! Elena! You slap me! Stop! 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 You! Stop! You down! Michelle said you were looking for me. Why did you go picking a fight with Elena and her friends again? Alina made me a laughing stock before everybody. And then you went on flexing your muscles with her. Mike Tyson. Hasn't she done worse in the past that you ignored? Why would you fail this time? What did you want me to do? First it was Anna. Now it's Alina. What do you always want me to do about these people? Ignore them. Ignore them as much as possible. They are all distractions. You should know you're a leader and everyone in the school is looking up to you one way or the other. I'm sorry if I say that wrongly. God forbid, I can't grant such requests. What do you mean? <laughs> Why do you seem so frail when it has to do with Naomi? Or do you also have anything to do with her? Are you normal? Do you want me to have any problem with Felix? Huh? Felix is using Naomi. Maybe you should open your eyes. Let her find out herself. <clears throat> I thought I told you and your friends to stick around and find a loophole in which we could strike. But no, you ended up messing things apart and getting yourself expelled and you expect me to do my job and the one you failed to do out of unnecessary carelessness what do you what do you take me for hey. so what would have been wrong if you had done the both task see if you fail to do this you will never have blessing is this a joke how did you know about Blessing and I. I know what I want to know. <laughs> you always want to know everything. Mm. Mm. Okay, I'll tell you the truth. I don't have a boyfriend now. And I don't intend to have one anytime soon. Uh, why? My parents, and then this school, 
I don't want to be a scapegoat. And lastly, I don't want boys wala either. Like, they ask for the impossible now. And who said there's something wrong giving out the impossible? Kiki. Yes, sweet. Oh, you think I don't understand? <laughs> you know nothing. As for Ben, he's just wasting his time. So, you don't like Ben? <laughs> it's not about Ben. It's about self-respect and sanctity. <laughs> yeah. That was a long time ago. I never knew you two could be in speaking terms. Well, yeah, things hadn't gone south between us then. How do you mean? Blessing and I used to be very close friends. Then what happened? She ruined everything. I mean, everything for my friend, Elena. Hi. Hi. Um, Felix, right? Yes, Felix. Okay. Sure. Why did you leave your former school? Oh, everyone likes this school, right? Sure. But also, we relocated. Oh. Okay. I like how you coordinate yourself in class. Thanks. You're smart and intelligent too. Thank you. What do you think about your friend Kiki? Kiki? How do you mean? She disturbs me a lot about Elena. I don't know what to say about that, but all I can say is you should forget about everyone and everything. Just focus on what brought you here, which is studying. Unless you might get distracted. Hi, Felix. I'll see you later, okay? Okay. Kiki, what's up? What did you say to him? Nothing. We were just chatting. Just chatting? What? Felix, what's up? Hi, bro. And what was the meaning of that, Felix? How? What do you mean by how? You embarrassed me in front of my friend. I'm, I'm sorry if I embarrassed you. But I don't think I and Elena is going to work out anyway. I don't 
don't care what you told or did not tell Felix. Stay away from Felix and stay away from me. Keith, what do you mean by this? I didn't do anything. I won't repeat myself again. Rubbish. Kiki, Kiki, wait. Now that you both are like cat and dog, how will you convince her in my favor? Tell me. Leave that to me. I have blessing secrets. Just what I've asked you to do. And blessing is all yours. <laughs> Good evening, John. Why are you doing this? Despite all that has happened, you're still part of the family. You come home. I am not coming home, Mom. And besides, I have no use in your life. How can you bend on divorce? You know what? All I want to hear is that you are gone. Why would you say that to me, John? How is that? You can call him up on the phone. You see? You both are still up against each other. How, how can I survive on that sort of suffocation? I don't understand. Tomorrow is your sister's visiting day. You tell her I love her. Goodbye, mom. John, don't hang up on me. And mom, go fix your home. John. The clothes your mother brought from her grave. Sorry. Pick up. Why are my clothes on the floor? They are lying there with your mother. Of, sorry, pick up. They are lying with a, with a witch of a mother in Abyss. Yes, I did. Please, can I? Run again, please. Came from the smitty, you can see I'm the hardest. I'll tell you, can't count all the times I was beaten and broken. Came from the ground and the rocks and shaped deep in the molten fire and straight in my heart. My soul, I'm a spirit, you are broken and bended like pottery. They thought it was sorcery. Came from dirt, they called me filthy. Well, I was glitchy, but only my maker could see this. I was refined by the vine and I came to the light. See, the stars in the sky were just Jealous my light, when my light hits the cloud, it could blind your sight. So to recite my rhymes like I'm Shakespeare, piercing through your soul with my words when I'm not there. And the dance that was made was a favorite, I can't tell. The act, the story, that was the talent. It gave me a purpose regardless the setbacks. It pardoned my boat through the storm and the rain. On the trouble sea, I wouldn't accept the feet. It was my pride, my talent, a shoulder to lean on. Everything I was to lean on. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine This little light of mine I'm gonna let it shine Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine This little light of 